Mother to Anthesa girl, are you there? I'm alright mother, I'm just having trouble on which planet to go to. What do you mean? Well, there's three planets in front of me, the planet on the left is Glongazark, the planet on the center is Glurkatari, and the planet on the right, is Blood Devil. Well, I know not to go in Blood Devil, that planet is a dead end. And Smirkatari is just a military planet, so I think the only option you have to go to is Glongazark. Okay, I'll go there. Mayday mayday, I've been it, I'm going down. Man, that was a hard crash landing, thank god that I survived. Hey Mayor, I heard a crash sound from near the scaredy farm, should we check it out? Sure thing Artoki, let's go find out what that sound was. Uh oh, I better use my invisibility powers to hide. Oh my goodness, a UFO has landed on our planet. But surprisingly, there's no creature in there, unless... Unless what? Unless the creature used invisibility powers to hide from us. Well, if you are using your invisibility powers, then please show yourself. I promise that we won't hurt you. Okay, I'll reveal myself. you, and why are you on my planet? Well, my name is Invis E-Girl, and it was because today was Planet Moving Day. Planet Moving Day? I don't know what that is. Well, on my planet, in Viberg, Planet Moving Day is where one Invis E-In goes to live on a different planet, and that Invis E-In is me. Oh. Well, in that case, welcome to Glongspell. Wait, I thought this planet is called Glongos Ark. It is. But, on the Glonk side, we like to call it Glonk Spell. Oh, well, that makes sense then. Well, since you and you on this planet, why don't we all show you around? That sounds great. Okay, Invisi Girl, this is my scaredy form. I pay Miss Shriek whenever she does a good job. Wait, who's Miss Shriek? That girl over there. Wow, no wonder why it's called a scaredy farm. Do you think that I should try it out? Why sure, since you have invisibility, I think it's really useful. Hey, where did she go? Boom. Wow, I'm really impressed. Maybe you and the street can help each other out. Well, of course. This is the village of Glongspell, it's where all Glongs live in. Wow, it's pretty cool. Um, who lives in that orange and purple house? Oh, well, that is our board's house. Can I see him? Sure. So, you're the one who's Elvog, correct? Yeah, that's right. But you know, I wasn't always so much really indifferent. Oh? How so? 
I can tell you my story, if you don't mind. Okay, go for it. It all started when I was a normal bloke. I discovered some weird purple goose stuff. I looked at it to see if it was edible. But then I started to feel woozy and went to sleep for about 10 seconds. When I woke up, I discovered awesome powers of a superhero. And that is my story. Wow, seems like you've been through a lot, huh? Well, I got used to it by now, so I'm good now. So? How are you liking the long spell? You know what? I think I like this planet. It feels like home to me. Well, just remember, we always have a way of making you feel welcome. <laughs>